um, dad took guardianship of a lot of kids, and a lot of those kids are not our relatives, and he has a different set of rules for the kids who are relatives and the kids that are not. There aren't that many of us. As far as I know, there's two of us. There's me, and then there's my son, my child, and um, that's it. And um, the closest, you know, any kind of casual relationship, and I think with uh, the kid, I, I think, uh, you know, he is a friend of the family and is known to him. The rest, I don't know really what their relationship is like, but um, I think I saw one of them, you know, 19 years ago, and... Uh, you know, basically, it's a, uh, I'll call you kind of thing, don't call me. Uh, it gets him out of a bad situation and uh, stabilizes him somehow. But, uh, you know, with uh, blood relatives, it's different. Still, you know... Um, you know, like, if I pester him someplace, he's going to close that office and move. And I'm going to have to hunt him down another place. But, um, it's just because he's got a lot to do. And, uh, but he wouldn't do that for the others, you know. So, anyway, um, you know, like, 19 years ago or so, he was still bringing it, picking up new ones. I think, um... Oh, I, he plans to live a long time. He's really healthy. But, um, I don't know about the continuing, the foster, the guardianship thing is going on. And sometimes that's an issue some people will raise. If you're treating the kids you're the guardian of different, if you're admitting to treating the kids you're the guardian of different than the kids that are your blood relatives. So, um. Anyways, in terms of explaining what the difference is, I don't actually, I've got some sense of what their rules are because sometimes people um, will um, comment on knowledge of uh, my affiliation with him and what he was doing. And um, we know that the pedophiles were, um, you know, playing him somewhat. So, um, but the, the boys... Um, a lot of them had the potential to be able to amount to something. I don't know how many of them did. Um, the girls, you know, like everybody, the dialogue was that the girls really don't need those opportunities. But I heard somebody say today, and I, this might be unrelated, that people who get the general diploma should be homeschooled. Um, if you've got an issue like that and you're being homeschooled to be as functional as possible, you should get the general diploma. But the regular schools should not offer it. I think, um, you know, they mainstreamed, or they tried to, you know, combine the schools, stuff like that. I was never at a different kind of school. I was at a private school for a while, but it was, you know, all different kid, t types of kids. Not a school for retarded kids or anything. So, um, and then, you know, I was in pre-calculus. You know, it's weird. Um, had a reading level way in advance of my classmates. Anyway, but like I said, you know, it's uh, one of those things where they don't want too much oversight on that. And uh, Barney should have dealt with this. The dad didn't have to skip that meeting. Whoever you are out there who's not going to get your 50%.